Hello, this is Patrick with 1CNC West and welcome to 1CNC. Now, in this training video, what we're going to do is first take a look at the 1CNC main toolbar, which is located over here on the left hand side of the screen. Now, this main toolbar is divided into three different categories. There's a drawing category for working with wireframe geometry. There's a modeling category for working with solids and surfaces. And there's a CAM category dedicated to working with toolpaths. Now, I should also point out that each one of these options has an icon to the left and a brief description on the right hand side. To select an option, simply take your cursor and left hand mouse click. Once you do that, you're presented with the submenu. Now, you'll also notice in some cases within the submenu, there's already a default option already selected for you. You'll see that if the option is highlighted in yellow. In this case, you can see the point option's already been selected for us, so we can go right to work. If we want to select a different submenu option, just simply take your cursor again and left hand mouse click. It's very, very simple. Notice too that if I head into the line category, there's also a default option selected within the submenu. Same with arcs. You'll see the little yellow there. So whenever you see a yellow highlight, you can tell that the option's already been pre-selected for you as a default. But you're never locked into that. You can always left hand mouse click and select something different. Now, to get back to the main menu, you can take your cursor and go all the way to the left and select any one of these main menu icons. For example, if I wanted to go into trimming, I could select the trim icon and then here's our trim submenu. Also note too, there's no default option selected here as none of these are selected in yellow. We can select shapes, lines, arcs, surfaces, anything that you'd like to select. You can easily get to that just by selecting the main menu icon located on the left hand side of the screen. Now, when you're first learning 1CNC, you might not remember all these icons. So what you might want to do is use the home button. This is located in every submenu. Simply click on the home button and it will take you back to the main menu where it shows both the icon and the brief description on the right hand side of the screen. Thanks so much for watching. In the next video, we're going to take a look at the remaining parts of the user interface. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you then.